Hello everyone! Welcome or welcome back here on my channel. This is me once again, Teacher Jinjin, your virtual teacher here on YouTube. Kung bago ka pa lang sa channel na ito, gumagawa ako ng mga Tagalog tutorial videos mula grade 7 hanggang grade 11. Kung interesado ka, please like, subscribe, at i-click mo na rin ang notification bell para ma-notify ka kapag may bago akong upload na video. Dito naman tayo sa activity 2, letter B. Meron tayong mga given, m of x equals 5x minus 3, n of x equals x plus 4, c of x equals 5x squared plus 17x minus 12, at ang c of x natin ay x minus 5 over x plus 2. Ang number 1 natin is m plus n of x. So, anong gagawin natin dito? This is simply means m of x plus n of x. And then, substitute natin yung F m of x, that is 5x minus 3 plus, ang n of x naman natin is x plus 4. Combine like terms, 5x plus x equals 6x, negative 3 plus 4 equals positive 1. So, this is now the final answer. Number 2, we have m times n of x. So, dito naman, multiply natin. So, m of x times n of x. Ang m of x natin ulit is 5x minus 3. Multiply natin sa x plus 4. Pwede natin gamitin yung FOIL method. So, that is first, 5x times x equals 5x squared Yung outer naman, 5x times positive 4 equals positive 20x. Yung inner naman, negative 3 times x equals negative 3x. And then yung last term, negative 3 times positive 4 equals negative 12. Combine like terms, 5x squared, 20x minus 3x equals positive 17x minus 12. So this is now the final answer. Number 3, we have n minus c of x. So, ito naman, n of x minus c of x. Ang n of x natin is x plus 4 minus, ang c of x natin is 5x squared plus 17x minus 12. Ang gagawin natin dito, i-distribute muna natin yung negative sign dito sa loob ng parenthesis. So, magiging x plus 4 Negative times 5x squared equals negative 5x squared. Negative times positive equals negative 17. Negative times negative equals positive 12. Combine like terms. So, unahin na natin yung negative 5x squared. Wala naman siyang kasama. So, may x dito. And then, yung may x naman, x minus 17x equals negative 16x. And then, 4 plus 12 equals positive 16. So, this is now the final answer. Number 4, we have C over M of X. So, this is simply means C of X over M of X. Ang C of X natin is 5X squared plus 17X minus 12 over, ang M of X naman natin is 5X Minus 3. So, ang gagawin natin dito, i-factor muna natin yung nasa numerator. Pwede tayong mag-trial and error method. So, since prime factor yung 5x, so 5x times x yan. mag tayo ng factors ni negative 12. So, it, since positive ito, kaya positive at negative dapat. Kung itatry natin, Yung positive 3 at negative 4, dapat 17x yung magiging middle term natin. So, 3x plus negative 20x, hindi siya pwede. So, ibig sabihin, magiging negative 17x siya. So, hindi pwedeng positive 3 at negative 4. I-try nating negative at positive. Negative 3 times x equals negative 3x and then... 5x times positive 4 equals positive 20x at negative 3x plus 20 equals positive 17x. 
So, our factor is 5x minus 3 times x plus 4 over 5x minus 3. Kung mapapansin ninyo, pwede natin i-cancel yung 5x minus 3 and then ang matitira na lang is x plus 4. Okay? So, ang tip ko sa inyo kapag nag-factor kayo, itry nyo munang isolve yung nasa denominator niya kung factor niya ba yun. Para hindi na kayo mag-trial and error. Okay? Then, number 5, we have M composed of N or M circle N of X. So, dito naman, yung M of X, papalitan natin ng value ng N of X. So, di ba ang M of X natin is 5X minus 3, ang N of X natin is X plus 4. So, yung X dito... So, that is 5x minus 3, papalitan natin ng x plus 4. Kasi yung m, compose niya yung n. Kaya, that is 5 times x plus 4 minus 3. Then, simplify. 5 times x equals 5x. Then, 5 times 4 equals positive 20 minus 3. Then, simplify again. 5x, positive 20 minus 3 equals positive 17. So, this is now the final answer. Number 6, we have n circle C of negative 3. So, dito naman, gagawin muna natin yon bago natin i-substitute yung negative 3. So, yung n, compose daw siya ng C. Kaya, papalitan natin ng C of x yung x dito. Magiging 5x squared plus 17x minus 12 plus 4. Again, yung x dito, pinalitan natin ng C of x. Kasi, yung n, compose niya yung C. Then, simplify. That is equal to 5x squared plus 17x. Negative 12 plus 4 equals negative 8. This is now the n circle C. Ngayon, kailangan nating i-substitute yung negative 3 dito. So, that is 5 times negative 3 squared plus 17 minus 8 is equal to 5. Negative 3 squared equals 9. Dapat may x pala to. So, may x dyan. Minus 8. So, that is 17 times negative 3 minus 8. Then, simplify. 5 times 9 equals 45. 17 times negative 3 equals negative 51 minus 8. Then, simplify. Pagsamahin muna natin to. Negative 51 minus 8 equals negative 59. So, 45 minus 59 is equal to negative 14. So, this is now the final answer. Then, lastly, we have N composed of M compose of m of 2. So, ang gagawin naman natin dito, palabas tayo. Ang una nating isolve is yung nasa loob, saka natin isolve yung nasa labas, at yung pang huli. So, unahin muna natin yung m of a uh, function of m of 2. Yung x sa m, papalitan natin ng 2. m of 2. So, that is 5 x minus 3 equals 5 times 2 minus 3. 5 times 2 equals 10 minus 3 and 10 minus 3 equals 7. Yan yung m of 2. And then, yung m of 2, isasubstitute natin ulit sa m. So, m of m of 2. So, that is 5 times ang m of 2 natin is 7 minus 3. 5 times 7 equals 35 minus 3 is equal to 32. And then, n naman. So, yung n of m of m of 2. Okay, so marami yan. Ang n of x natin ay x plus 4. Palitan natin ng 32 yung x. So, 32 plus 4 equals 36. Okay? So, baka may mali lang sila sa answer key kaya. Pero, ito yung final answer. So, yun lamang. Maraming salamat sa inyong panonood. Once again, stay home, stay safe, stay healthy at mag-aaral ng mabuti. God bless you all and goodbye!